Good Tuesday evening to you. I'm Chief Meteorologist Richard Scott. I want to give you a weather update. What's happened across Alabama? Numerous trees and power lines down from some storms rolled through earlier this evening and tonight. Those storms are ending pretty quickly, but some additional storms are still possible. I think overnight tonight and during the day tomorrow for Wednesday. Not going to rain all day, but there will be some storms around. Some of those could pack a punch, becoming stronger, possibly severe. I don't think we see as widespread of a wind damage event for tomorrow for Wednesday, but keep in mind there could be some localized areas some strong gusty winds and some heavy rain. By the time we go into Thursday, all the rain should be out of here, although I still can't rule out a shower or a storm on Thursday. The chance for rain for any one spot about a 20% or so for Thursday. As we go into Friday through the weekend, the upper air ridge builds back in place. That means the heat bubble is back and again, the big story I think over the weekend will be the heat as temperatures top out of the upper 90s to near 100. And uh, keep in mind the heat index this weekend will be topping out uh, near 103 to 108. So take it easy if you're going to be working outdoors for Saturday, Sunday, even on Friday. We're talking about some really hot temperatures around here. We wouldn't be surprised to see another heat advisory issue for parts of Alabama as we go into Friday through the weekend. Uh, the story though for the weekend we will be mainly dry. A few storms ending tonight. Overnight lows back at the 70s. Tomorrow will top out in the mid to upper 90s. A hot day, but there will be some scattered storms around. Some of those could pack a punch, but not all of you will see rain tomorrow. A chance for any one spot about a 40% getting rain. Thursday and Friday, the risk of rain really going downhill. In fact, for Friday, uh, through the weekend, only about a 10% chance for a shower or storm, mainly sunny Thursday through the weekend, even next week, looking mostly dry and very hot.